It's just about uh, 5.30 in the morning. It's uh, 5 hours and 36 minutes into the day of uh, Sunday, December 7th, 2014. As they were starting, we're doing our new format for the, uh, the BTS vlog. Uh, trying to do more more sh shorter vlogs, se shorter segments during the day. Uh, to bring this more into line with uh, the other vloggers that are out there. So rather than doing one long summary we just do it as uh, as events occurred and yeah so I just got up uh, I went to rest for about two hours uh, just to rest my eyes my eyes had gotten very sore uh, when you do a lot of reading that happens the eyes are particularly the muscles around the uh, eyelids and the uh, the eye socket start to get bruised actually and you need to go lie down shut your eyes and uh, uh, let the eyes sort of recover from this but anyways I'm back and uh, just around 7 7 30 I'll be leaving for church and I won't be back until 1 32 o'clock in the afternoon so uh, we'll see I, I should be able to vlog when I come back I should be able to sort of get enough uh, <laughs> I have enough stamina to, to do that uh, But uh, the the I've done repair repair work on the sink. I have to start doing my own notes for uh, the next uh, news broadcast on the over the week. I have to do the weekend broadcast for INN. I have the uh, headlines and beyond. If you're looking watching that um, news uh, news uh, show, uh, we're doing things that that nobody else on uh, on 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 any news program is doing. We're taking taking a look at things that other people won't look at. Uh, and it is difficult. There's a lot of research notes involved in it. And this is on top of the uh, work in physics, the quantum physics, the chemistry, the medicine, all the areas of research that I've gone into. Uh, these things are all sewn together with INN. And there's a particular reason for this, is that when you decide to go out and do uh, research on your own independent research, uh, you need to remember that all of the research is being done within government, so there is a political aspect to things. And in order to exist within this political, political sphere that exists in the world as a research institute, there needs to be a, a political component that sort of uh, becomes your ship. In other words, you're in a political sea. What holds you into that political sea? How do you survive in that political sea? Well, you need a ship. And INN is the construction of this political ship, which is based in Democratic Earth. And you'll be seeing more of this come out as well. Uh, Democratic Earth is a model like the UN, but rather being based on socialism, it's based on individual demo uh, individualist democracy. Uh, rather than being a social, I'm not a socialist, uh, I'm an individualist. I don't believe in parties, I don't believe in uh, you know large governments, uh, keep things as small as possible. Uh, I do come off as a conservative because uh, I have Christian values, but if you look at my Christian values, uh, they're, com they're completely different from uh, what most people think of Christian values. So uh, there again, there is a, 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 there's a, a huge difference there. And uh, this is sort of what needs to be brought out. And the only way to do that and sort of get you to see behind the scenes as uh, more work wraps up is... Uh, uh, to uh, do more vlogging during the day, and it's, as you can, so I'm just gonna do like uh, between about five six minutes, and that's about it. And then, uh, you know, more frequently throughout the, throughout the more frequently throughout the day. So uh, that's how we'll sort of bridge uh, <laughs> the gaps between things, <laughs> if you will. I don't. Oh, 
Sometimes you tie like this, you don't realize, you don't know if if what you're saying actually makes sense. Sometimes you have to think about it a little bit more and come back and correct it later on in another segment. So, anyways, I gotta get my notes set up here, and then I also gotta start doing some dishes. <laughs> yeah, dishes have to be done. I fixed the pipe that the prevented me from doing the different dishes, so now I can sort of clean the backlog up and get working on there. <laughs> <laughs> on that. <laughs> All right. Uh, take it easy, and I'll see you in the next uh, segment of the uh, BTS vlog. All right, everybody. Yeah. We're doing another segment of the BTS vlog. Give me a, let me give you the time and date stamp. It is... I'm going to turn that down. 15 hours and 50 minutes into the day of Sunday, December 7th, 2014. And yay for me, because I am vlogging. Yeah, it's near the end of the day for me. Uh, uh, my, uh, my whole body just literally exhausted. Uh, I'm going to watch some cartoons, uh, have something to drink, to hydrate. And uh, then uh, go to bed. Uh... I like going to church because I have a lot of uh, uh, friends there. And we all hang out, we talk, and have more or less a good time. It's kind of like going to somebody's house for dinner. Excuse me? Somehow a hair got in my mouth. <laughs> I think it's from the beard. Anyways, um, had my, uh, sort of, if you will, a, my weekly, uh, festive party, my feast party. And then, uh, after that, I ended up, uh, uh, going to my parents' house for another, uh, big, uh, lunch. And then from there, it was, uh, where would we go from there? Oh, then from to here. And now I'm just sort of, uh, kind of perusing, uh, YouTube. And I said, I wanna, there's a car cartoon I want to watch. Kind of, uh, gets me, uh, ready for bed. It's kind of, it sort of, uh, allows me to take the foot off the gas pedal, if you will. And just sort of really relax. And that's kind of what that's kind of what I need. It's you know, it's, there's a oh, 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 oh. there is basically a uh, view that I can't remember what I'm talking about now. <laughs> issue of coherence when you get tired like this uh, things that are in your mind kind of slip out and you kind of forget what you're going to say I mean this how happens to vloggers in general when they run out of, <laughs> run out of topics because you know what do I do now I'm out of topic <laughs> help video suggestions down below you know and the other thing I haven't been doing is I have been telling you to uh, to uh, to th like, subscribe, and thumbs you know like, subscribe, and comment. That's right. So it's like that's the up the thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't already subscribed, and then comment down below. And if you want to comment down below, uh, I do try to reply in the comments down below. But more often than not, uh, I reply to the comments down below. Uh, in my video so if you put a comment down below I will comment back in the video give you a shout out so if you kind of want that then go ahead uh, I will do that uh, I don't mind what the comment is it's, you know I really don't mind what the, what the comment is uh, so that doesn't bother me so yeah do what you feel anyways uh, how about I just wanted to do this quick vlog when I came back. And, um, uh, now I'm just going to sort of, I'm hydrating. 
I'm gonna watch a cartoon. Uh, I've checked my email. There's nothing pressing that came in, and then that way I'll be able to I'll be able to sort of set my schedule for uh, later on tonight when I get up around. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'll probably be getting up around uh, one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> yep, I'll be starting my day at one o'clock in the morning. We'll see it. We're gonna start seeing the time shifting again. Anyways, uh, that's it for now. I'll see you in the next segment of the BTS vlog. Alrighty, bye bye. <laughs> Well, hello everybody. Uh, welcome back. As I said we're gonna try to try to vlog more during the day. Let me just adjust this a little bit more. Here we go. I'm trying to vlog more throughout the day to give a better perspective of what's going on on a daily basis. I don't go anywhere, so this is how it's gonna work. I can't take the camera with me. Uh, this is just the way it is. And so we're seeing more of what I do on a daily basis. See that more of that day. Rather than describing what happened way back when, uh, I think I'll, I'm going to try doing this on a more periodic uh, basis throughout the day. Anyways, I just uh, got up. I was going to get up and stay up, uh, but uh, my body's kind of tired, so I got up around 4.30, had something to eat, watched some uh, Bertelli, and... Uh, Basically now, about two and a half hours later, but Britannia and um, uh, and uh, Britannia, Clintus and um, where is it? Yeah, Britannia, Clintus and uh, Mommy and Gracie. Those are the shows that I watched. And then I also did some work. I did some work on the news. Uh, I did some work on the news channel, uh, sort of fixed things up a little bit on the Google Plus page. Then I did some work on Cyborg Alpha TV 2. That's my administrative channel that I used to administer the entire network, the uh, Cyborg Alpha TV network. Uh, so that I did work on there. Uh, I'm going to go back in a few minutes and upload uh, another episode of the IMO vlog. That's going to take about four and a half, five hours to upload, so it probably won't be up until uh, noon or something like that. And that, when, that's when I'll eventually get up again. And uh, sort of, I'm going to push for an all nighter again. I'm going to try to do another all nighter. Uh, it's a really good time, what time it is. So, like I said, I got up around 4.30. Uh, it's now uh, six hours and 49 minutes into the day of Monday, December 8th, 2014. And, um, I should get up again, this, I should be up at least by, by, by 5 o'clock in the afternoon anyways. Depends on how long I end up staying this thing asleep, asleep for. That could be, I could be asleep for anywhere for 4 to 5 hours to longer, to about 8 hours. So, uh, when I get up again, I'm going to take my, ex my extended sleep as a vacation. Uh, and then from there, I'm going to try to push today, the today on schedule is to ramp up and try to do the maximum amount of work I can get done during the day here. In other words, I'm going to try and push it as far as I can go. And so uh, that will that will sort of see uh, uploads on the Cyborg Alpha TV network uh, across the network more frequently. That means more uh, posts to Cyborg Alpha TV 2. That's going to I said, Cyborg Alpha TV 2 is going to look at the entire network, so there will be shows from all the different areas. Uh, and eventually, we'll be going out to uh, Physics TV eventually to do this. In other words, we're going to take what's going on on uh, Cyborg Alpha TV 2 and then migrate it uh, sometime in January over to Physics TV. And then once that's happened, Physics TV will become the sort of the main channel, if you will. And uh, we're going to sort of, you know, bit by bit uh, pull everything, the entire Cyborg Alpha TV network under the physics TV uh, umbrella type of thing. Uh, and said what will happen is that basically uh, uh, as this happens, we'll become more and more of a full-fledged network. We'll have more and more content out there. The amount you can choose from and the type of shows that you can choose from will, be, will, will grow greatly. Because uh, we are... We, I look, I look, I'm aiming to produce 
a video, a one hour video, one hour of content every single day. If I can do that, then uh, I'll have a good flow to go up on, on a weekly basis. So, uh, And that will give viewers a real opportunity to use uh, Cyborg Alpha TV, the network, as a real channel. In other words, if you want to use this to cut the, you want to use YouTube to cut the, the uh, cable, you can do that. In other words, you don't have to go to other major networks to do this. So, anyways, uh, I hope uh, that sh uh, should be it for now. I am going to go back to bed. Uh, the other thing I'm gonna t I was sort of think mulling over is bringing uh, uh, Ubuntu BST. You know, to tell, bringing some of the details, because it's already done, a lot of the details back into BTS Lab, because I don't know if there's enough material right now, depending on how things are developing, to do a uh, weekly show on that. So I, uh, I'm going to sort of mull that over while I'm sleeping, and then uh, go from there. Uh, anyways, uh, I will talk to you in the next segment of the BTS vlog. All right, take it easy. And good night. <laughs> Well, hello everybody. Yeah, it's time for another segment of the BTS vlogs. Uh, it is two hours and twenty six minutes into the day of Tuesday, December 9th, two thousand fourteen, and we're about midway through our day. Um, wow, well, I think. Anyways, <laughs> the day has already started. Uh, a lot has already been done. I had. Uh, someone come over, one of my uh, students came over, and we had a uh, two, three hour discussion on, well, just basic things and, you know, uh, trying to, you know, have him understand where he is in life and the things that are going wrong. And also, we, I, I, a lot of times I use myself as an example of where things are might be headed or where I make my choices and how I make my choices. Because uh, a lot of times, uh, it is better to see an example simply uh, it is better to see an example of what needs to be done or what should be done rather than simply talking about what should be done and so talking is one part but also you need to see something get done uh, beyond the talking so and this is kind of where the narrative comes out is that you know yeah speeches are nice but uh, actually getting something done is better and at some, at some point in time if all you offer are speeches piece of paper just fell. If all you offer are speeches and nice words and nothing ever comes of them, then at some point in time people are going to go and walk away because, well, what else is there to do? And, uh, that's kind of uh, where we are now. I've been going through my usual playlist. Uh, I'm right now at uh, uh, a channel called Swim Love Peace. And so I'm here now. Uh, I went by my usual my usual route. Uh, that's uh, Bertelli, uh, Katie's mama. Let me get this written here. Bertelli, Katie's mama. Clintus, uh, Shade Tards, uh, One Crazy Life for Me, and now on a, a second or sort of a sub list now, where I was at Santastic. Then now I'm at uh, Swim Love Peace, and I'll be sort of going through my list, my uh, my uh, sort of uh, Disney uh, uh, Nickelodeon replacement list, if you will I'll call it that. Um, as I'm doing uh, some pretty hefty research, there's a lot of work getting done, and a lot more stuff will be coming up. But to do all that, that means that I have to sort of push myself beyond where I, I normally push myself. I have to start adding in uh, new levels of studying and because there's actually not a lot, uh, there's no extra time in the 24-hour day to do this, that means I have to find areas that are not being efficiently used and find ways to make them that time more efficient and put stuff in there that I normally wouldn't be doing in there. Not to actually end up making myself work harder, but end up being more efficient. In other words, take the inefficiencies and make them more efficient and that way you get more work done. And that's kind of where we are now. Uh, I sort of needed to take a little bit of a break from, I'm writing up the uh, the script for the new, uh, for the uh, news broadcast that will be out on Tuesday, the news the episode of, uh, uh, of INN's uh, Headlines and Beyond that's coming up on Tuesday night. It will be out. Uh, and that, I think we'll be able to get 
to three three uh, shows a week for that three episodes a week. Uh, I'm still a little bit behind on uh, my inst my uh, IMO vlogs. I've got uh, one to catch up on and one uh, so in other words, I have to I have to do two insta vlog two IMO vlogs this week to sort of catch up and get everything done that I need to get done. And uh, I think the vlogs are going to be coming along too because I've got uh, a new set of vlogs from the last thing in the in the editing bay, and I think by the end of the month by the uh, our first anniversary, our, our, our anniversary on December December 31st, that we'll be able to bring, um, we'll be able to bring Cyborg Alpha TV. Uh, no, wait, 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 yeah, we'll be able to bring Cyborg Alpha TV network fully online. But uh, we'll be caught up with the BTS logs as well. So uh, look for that. And. Um, yeah, I'm back to my work now. I have to go back to my work. I've got a fair bit of uh, uh, writing to do. Anyways, I'll see you in the next uh, segment of the BTS Vlogs. Be prepared to have what you know challenged by Simon Alpha TV Network. Yeah, it's 2 o'clock in the morning, just about. It's time to get my day started. As you may notice, the day is shifting again. <laughs> uh, this is a, something that's consistent, that my day always shifts forward. Uh, it's about, about every two weeks, my, day, my, day, my time when I'm awake, when I'm starting my day, shifts forward. And uh, it causes the fatigue results. So anyways... It is one hour and fifty-three minutes into the day of Tuesday, December 9th, two thousand fourteen, and um, things are going well. Uh, I, you know, there are issues still that has to be worked. I mean, this is the thing: as you start getting used to something, every time you you achieve a new level and start to move forward a bit, a little bit further, uh, what ends up happening is that uh, there are always things you find that you have to work out. That there are issues that pop up. Uh, so you'll resolve one issue, one set of issues, and then you end up moving on. And as you move on, you find a whole new set of issues that you have to deal with and resolve those. And maybe you have maybe a day or two before you, you move, you, you nudge yourself forward enough that you find another set of new issues. And you know it, it, it's the sort of that cycle over and over and over again. And the thing is, is as, as long as you're finding new issues and sort of moving forward, then that's all right. But it does get uh, to a certain degree, there, there's a bit of tedium here. It does get tiring uh, to always have to sort of uh, be dealing with issues. But the, this, the thing is, if you're not dealing with the issues, then you're actually not moving ahead. So um, the research desk has grown. I said I did the major physical upgrades last year. Uh, not, only, not not last year, it was actually a couple months ago the, ma the major work was done. Uh, I gotta go back and check. I think it was, yeah, just over the summer I've, I've, I did the finalized work, the, the, you know, the, the major work. So, and uh, now the work, work is starting to spread from the main system here out onto tablets. There's work being done on the IPTV, so, and the uh, test bench is done, the first version of the test bench is done. Uh, but <laughs> as I said, uh, as you finish something, uh, one thing, the new th another thing pops up because I finished the first version of the test bench, and as I finished it, uh, there's not enough room, so I have to physically expand the, the test bench. So uh, that's going to have to be another project. So uh, we'll see how that ends <laughs> up working out. You know. Um, these are, these, are, these are things that are, are issues that have to be dealt with. Uh, I'm pretty sure as the regular network here grows that uh, I'm going to have to sort of find ways of, of consolidating space rather than simply having physical systems around, start linking systems together more. Uh, in, in a, uh, more better isn't is a proper term, but uh, they're, they're good right now. But 
give me an example. I don't have equipment right now where I can uh, link a whole bunch of systems together. I don't have that just yet. I don't have that skill just yet. To link a whole bunch of systems to get, stay here, but work on these systems remotely. So I want to do, let's say, I want to do video editing. Right now, I actually have to do go work, do work on the uh, on, it, on the editing station on the editing bay. I actually have to physically go over to the editing bay and uh, do work on it. Uh, if I could s s work sit here and work on the edit edi editing bay over there, that will be a great thing. But uh, I haven't gotten to that point yet. Uh, I just now I'm just now test benching um, uh, the 64-bit uh, Linux because they realized the 32-bit Linux wasn't sort of cutting out for video editing for the heavier stuff like MTS. Uh, you really do need the 64-bit uh, Linux. So um, that moved the uh, clustering program, the, which allows me to do remote logins. Uh, that pr has been shoved off to another level of projects. So it's been shelved for now. Uh, but I do see a need for it. The need is coming up right now. Managing with what's hap with, with the way things are now, but things could be better. And this is the whole thing: is that as you see, realize that things are working well, but you're now starting to see that things are starting to get cramped and crowded. Uh, at some point in time, you're going to have to bring that project forward and uh, use it to resolve problems that are starting to occur on the desk here. So, uh, and that means also. Uh, working on the integration between uh, Android and Linux because uh, yes the Android systems are working well and they're somewhat linked together uh, the connection between the two sort of the integration uh, can also be better there also can be there's room for improvement there as well uh, I should have some of my, uh, my first test anime up uh, animation up uh, sometime this week music studio I still have work to do in there and the same thing with the uh, uh, the show TIY, uh, Toys DIY, that has to be worked on. So, <laughs> as I what I've done so far, uh, I'm rolling um, Ubuntu BSD Unix et al., the, uh, the work on, on Linux, into here. I don't think there's enough uh, uh, material to do a weekly show, so uh, I might do it monthly. I, I still haven't figured that out yet. Uh, so, uh, today is another day of seeing how far I can push things and uh what can be done so all right anyways i will talk to you hmm. a little later on maybe you know let's see if i try to vlog more throughout the day anyways see you then all right in the next segment of the bts vlog Democratic Earth. Earth.